Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the second Hive deck, Hive 2 from Brandon Hong and King's Wild Project. Uh, this is the second in the Hive series, designed and illustrated by Brendan Hong, and released by Jackson Robinson and the King's Wealth Project. It was funded on a crowdfunding uh, site, but through King's Wild Fund It, so it was actually uh, private through King's Wild only. It wasn't on Kickstarter or something else like that. Um, these cards were printed from the Expert Playing Card Company, and they were printed in two editions. There was this, this green standard edition, and then there was a limited edition of 750. Tuck Ace is uh, foil embossed, silver foil, and done in this green color, uh, wrapped throughout. Uh, it also has a little bit of embossing there as well. It says the hive across the front, the tuck case front has a lot of these interlocking circles. This side says King's Wild Artist Series, and so does this side. <laughs> the bottom has some ad copy about King's Wild Project, and the top says The Hive. Uh, you have these little rose uh, circled symbols all throughout uh, as well. And then the back design of the tuck case is the back design of the cards. Uh, there's no tuck seal, which I like. And then here you've got a little beehive right here, okay? And it's all done in silver foil. And then the inside tuck is lined with the little roses as well, and that's really cool. And then you've got some little ornamentation on the two little tuck flaps. So that is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. Here's a closer look at the back design. You can see those rose uh, icons in the corners, as well as the interlocking circles there in the center. The Hive 2, it's a really great deck. It holds true uh, not only to the series, but also gives the brand uh, a new look. I think that's cool. You know, Hive 1, uh, if you remember, I did a review for that a while back. It had a great kind of craft paper look that didn't have any graphic lines anywhere, but the Hive 2 is kind of the opposite. It's, it has a solid base of beautiful and varied line work with solid blocks of color. With this deck, you're gonna get two jokers. You're gonna get a single joker. He's holding a flower. He's kind of like looking down as he's walking. And then the second joker, uh, he's pulling bees out of a magic hat. Your ace of spades is a beehive in the center of a giant spade pip. And at the bottom, it says King's Wild Project. Your pips and indice cards are all completely original. Uh, you can see that the placement of the pips is original. The pips themselves are original. You've got a unique font up there in the corner as well. And so it kind of really ties the whole theme of the deck together, giving it a very original, very creative look. Brendan's courts are also unique for this deck as well. Each one of them has his unique, very cartoon uh, style look, and I think it really ties the deck together. Well, that is it for this deck review. As always, recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. Now, if you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, and instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. Thanks, bye.